Fox with the Grammy. The Grammy. Si tuko hapi leo. We are the Grammys. Muoneshe, muoneshe, muoneshe. Baba lao. Yo mambo vipi? I'm your host Sydney C. Kwa hapa Anashka TV na tuweze kusikia like what is trending today? Today is on a Monday. Ah. Kinacho trend kwa sasa hivi ni kutokea kule 255 uh, Tanzania. Kuna huyu jamaa ni ambaye ni promoter. Anahusika na masuala ya show. Napiga mashoko kuna anaconnect yani kama agent ni kama promoter like promoter and agent wa muziki ni kitu moja tu. So ye yeah, ako best kule US na akiwa US yeye ndo connect wasanii wa Tanzania kwenda kuperform huko kwenye ma uh, event kubwa kubwa kwenye stage kubwa kubwa zilizoko kule Marekani. Sasa kwa usiku wa kumkia leo ambapo kwao walikuwa bado mchana I think so jema huyu anayekwenda kwa jina Mr. Ligets. Ligets ni promoter mkubwa sana kule Marekani. Mashabiki wote wakina Diamond, wakina Alkiba, wakina Harmonize, wakina Mboso, wakina Zuchu wanazofanya. Jema huyu ni muhusika mkubwa kwa asilimia kubwa anahusika kwenye mashoa hayo kuyapanga na kujomsa ni yupi atakuja na yuji Ah, tangi event sasa ngapi atakuwa ni event wapi? Na maswala ya msanii atalala wapi hoteli nini nini ende ushibilika nayo like ende na book kila kitu. So Mr. Ligets kumkia usiku wa leo. So we hear all in the category. Ah, ameweza kuonesha kuonesha akiwa na ameweza kuonekana akiwa mtu mwenye hasira sana. Na jamaa huyu ameingia kwenye page yake ya Instagram na kupost and uh kintagi diamond platinum za kiba akielezea why okay i get it i get it you need business but at some point you need to stop and just keep giving us damn music sisi tulio uh, ngambo mnatukwaza for god's sake hamjaona jana whiskey ayo guys can't keep fighting among ourselves na hii nazungumza nazungumza kama kaka mkubwa ambaye nimepambana kufa na kupona na nyie hapa marekani facts at some point lazima tuache hizi beefs zisizo na tija na and go back to the competition bila ke jeli zenye nia ya need bila ke, ke jeli zenye nia ya kushikana kimziki Hisiyo hisi Simba uh, FC ya Tanzania na Yanga FC we need to we need kufika duniani na wote tuna wahitaji kwenye hi, vita hii jana the hashtag number one artist wa Afrobeat this year Davido Kampa SO ah uh, whiskey they are dominating the world sisi tuko tuna fight for the what Uh, bottom line let's focus on music and push push our music i truly love you and both of you na ndiye ndio tegemeo letu msifa, msifanye kazi kubwa iliyo fanyika uh, from day one iwe bure pesa nyingi na jasho nyingi limetu limetukika kwenye kupambania industry j kwenye pangeli kwenye industry nje ya mipaka na sasa mnaona namba zinashuka hashtag fats because of who ujinga yes i said let's focus and go to work uh, point blank provided hashtag truth hashtag promo so jamaa huyu alionekana kuwa mwenye ghadhabu sana na akaweza kuonekana like akiwa mtu amekasirika like uh, kinachoendelea Tanzania sio kitu kizuri kwa wasanii wakubwa kuonekana kila saa oh huyu ana mkejeli huyu oh sijui oh ni 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 yeye inatokea kulingana na uh, vita vinavyoendelea kati ya Diamond Platinums uh, alikiba na uh, huyu anaitwa Harmonize lakini Harmonize hayuko kwenye vita hivyo sana 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 
In fact, vita hivi alivyo uh, picha hizi alivyo post Mr. Liges zinamuhusisha yeye akiwa kwa picha moja na uh, Damo Platinum na akiwa kwenye picha nyingine ya pamoja na uh, Alikiba. So message hii uh, kwa a uh, njia nyingine na muendea aliye stab dam na yeye ndio anasikika kwenye kila event mara wao kamkejeli huyu mara wao kasema toeni nyimbo ambazo watu wanazishika kwenye siku moja mara wao sijui nyie what uh, mambo mingi sana jamaa huyu ambaye uh, amesikika kwenye event moja hapa kwenye interview moja na digital media kule TZ anasema kwamba yeye aliweza kukutana na damu platinum kule marekani akiwa pamoja na uh, meneja wake mr babutale na walikwenda hadi kwenye ofisi za grammy ambazo anasema kufika kule sio kitu rahisi ila walipambana sana na kuna jamaa mmoja ambaye alimpa connection jamaa huyo anaitwa black page jamaa kule ghana anasema watu wa west from the west like west africa wako na connection sana 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 so jamaa huyo aliweza kumpa connection na kumuunganisha na wenye wakubwa wenye grammy na matukio ya nikona diamond amepost yupo pale kwenye ile jengo la glam music awards pale alikuwa ampost akiwa pale mimi nikajua tu kwamba wewe ni mmoja kati ya watu ambao umempeleka umempeka diamond pale mimi for sure nilisema kwamba Diamond pale kaenda kutembelea tu kupiga picha lakini anasema sijui huyu mkurugenzi um, wa BT kampongeza kwamba kazi yake ni nzuri kama anampongeza namkubali kwa nini asimweke kwenye vitengo vya v, v, katika category zile za, za washindani wa zile tuzo lakini juzi nimekuja kuona mitandaoni kwamba ule ujio wenu nyinyi kwenda pale uh, kwenye zile tuzo za Grammy mlivyoenda pale imesaidia sana kiasi kwamba this time uh, Bongo Fever naye imepewa heshima imewekwa katika category fulani katika zile tuzo uh, wewe ni mmoja kati ya watu ambao umeplay nafasi kubwa sana. Tuelezee kwanza mchango wako mkubwa ume, umefanyaje ili mpaka hii nafasi tumeipata sio Tanzania. Historia ya, ya mziki wetu Ndiyo. na Marekani kwa mimi ulianza all the way back to 2005. Huyo alikuwa ni si mwingine bali ni msanii pedo kabisa ambaye alikuwa yuko hot sana alikuwa ni Mr. Nice. Oh, Miaka hiyo alifanya kazi kubwa sana na akafungua milango mingi na wengine wengi wamekuja. Mimi Of course kama unajua na Carlos Angeles nimejichanganya vizuri kule na watu wa mataifa tofauti mimi na jamaa yangu ambaye ni DJ mmoja mkubwa sana Los Angeles ni Mwafrika ni Mungana anaitwa Black Pages yani basi tu love aliponiona mimi na ngaika na maswala ya diamond kwa sababu anajua mimi napigania sana sasa yeye unajua hao wenzetu wa West ya wana wana connection sana akaniambia bro nataka nikupeleke mahali na tuka angalie nina magani ninaweza nikawasaidieni na nyie watu wa East Africa msikike akanintroduce kwa yule bwana wa Grammy uh, na uh, uh, Malo na hiyo na sisi tukuzubana na bahati nzuri Diamond pamoja amekuja hapa yuko busy na mambo mengi na ratiba ilikuwa iko very tight lakini uh, yuko na meneja yake anagusara sana yule Babtas yeah. kana hiyo tunaongea kitu uzima nikamwambia kaka hii ni lazima twende piga huo garagaza basi tukafarikiwa tukaenda pale tukaongea naye mambo mengi sana hasa tukaongea naye kama team you have a promoter host you have a artist una manager yani team nzima nzima imekamilika nimeshambulia yeah hili <laughs> swala ndio vile vile na huyo black pages mwenye alikuepo hasa pale tukapata fursa ya kujieleza hasa mm. na mimi sunajua ni kwa sababu mimi niko na mazingira hapo yeah. wewe ni mwepesi kulieleza kuonesha video kufanya nini. Mimi kuna siku yeah. na kuna document nitakuja kutengeneza siku moja. Mimi nazo hata clips za kila kitu baada ya siashe. Eh uliandika uli uli hiyo pia hata sky dieleza. Lakini tulifanya kikao kizuri sana. Na cha maana sana. Na ninashukuru wote kwa sababu mimi niliamini siku ile na nakumbuka hata niliandika kwenye Instagram yangu kwamba siku yetu inakuja. Kwa hiyo juzi nilipopata zile taarifa yani nilikuwa na furaha kubwa sana kwa yeah. sababu najua kwamba na wao wameelewa so na siku ile nakumbuka alitupa na maelekezo kabisa nini kinatakiwa kifanyike na mimi najua kinachotakiwa kufanyika tuombe kafanyia kazi kufanyia kazi hiyo ndio tutusaidie kwa hiyo ushauri wako kwa wasanii wa Bongo Fever wa sasa ambao wanaishi kupata hizo tuzo mm. au kushiriki katika hizo tuzo mm. yani ushauri wako washauri tu kwa hiyo mimi natumaini kabisa mm. kama kuna vitu vidogo vidogo tukijibadilisha 
yani tukajibaivisha sisi ndio tukajitafuta na navyo kusema kujitafuta kwa bahati mbaya sana hata kama sasa hivi naona mapiano zinawika hata penta nyimbo ma vibe na nini nini lakini sina uhakika na mashaka kama itaweza kukusaidia sana kwa sababu tumeona wenye mziki ndo wanakwenda wanajulikana pia sisi tunaonekana kama tuna tuna copy tuna copy lakini mimi nakumbuka mziki wetu ulikuwa bora sana enza kina pifa kama jana kina master j walitengeneza mangoma na hizi ah special hours ni wetu wakubwa mm. na mimi wakitulia chini wakaamua kwamba sasa tutaka tutengeneze kitu kitatupa identity yetu sisi utambulisho wetu utambulisho sasa tutaka wazungu wamshatuelewa ndio maana wameadi mungu fulani yeah. sasa kazi kwetu lakini ninavyoambia sasa hivi mm. upande wa Kenya kwenye genge wanajipanga ushauri wangu mimi ni simple Mm. Jambo la kwanza lazima tujiamini mm. lakini sina mwaka kama njia tunazotumia sasa ni sahihi. Yeah. Na hisi hizi njia si kama zinatupumbaza zina, zinaonekana kwa, kwa picha fulani kama lakini kiwalisia wakisikia anajua ah, ah, si wako hapo. Muziki wa South, muziki yeah. wa Nigeria. Wakati sisi tuna muziki bora kabisa. Ndiyo. Bora kabisa. Mimi nakumbuka kuna kijana ameimba aliimbaga singeli. Si sema kwamba watu waimbe singeli. Mm. Ndio mfano lakini nikuta siku moja Swiss beat na mkeo alishakizwa na wana vibe na na, na singeli. Yeah. Sasa sisemi kwamba singeli ndio solution lakini lazima tutafute kitu chetu. Tutafute utambulisho. Yeah Mr. Ligas anasema walienda wakakaa na mkubwa wa Grammy wakiwa pamoja na Diamond Platinumz yeye mwenyewe akiwa hapo na manager wa Diamond Platinumz ikawa ni kama team nzima. Na walienda wakakaa hapo kwenye meeting ambayo tuliona damu plan na mzee ameshare ya picha yeye wakati huo akisema uh, CEO wa Grammy amemtambua kwenye mziki zake au oh, kazi zake mzuri ila Mr. Ligets ameweza kutoa uh, na kusema kwamba ilikuwa ni meeting na ila uh, ni kitu kilikuwa kimepangwa sio si ati Diamond ali ali mwenye alijipele ali alipambana akafika huko no people behind the pages are Mr. Ligets na Mr. Black Page So uh folks we are the Grammy the Grammy Sisi tuko hapa leo We are the Grammys Mwoneshe 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 Baba lao genre manager for for this category so I basically get on the phone and, and email and call up people that uh, can be a, help us make sure that it's appropriate category Yeah right. So we hear all the music in the category and um Basically uh we can determine yes this is jazz great does everybody consider this this is good jazz category yes great and essentially that locks in the first the first ballot right okay. that makes sure that all of the music is in the right category that it's all good okay and from there it goes to the first vote okay. online so it goes online and for about a month and it's actually right here it shows you like uh first online sorry uh first round voting online voting you see how it says september 25th through october 10th yeah so that's that's the first round of voting okay. so from all of the records in those categories the members the recording academy members vote for their favorite records right that's right then we get uh we get back basically like Uh, a list of records we get back the top selections from okay. the membership and then we organize uh, nomination review meetings okay where essentially it's a group of you know very expert high level artists because this is a peer award you know this okay. is an okay. award that you know I don't choose who wins I'm making noise that are still pushing um but ultimately you know this is a community thing this is a much bigger thing than like you know just you or I you know this is like pulling other people up to to be part of this thing you know or to make sure that when there's a conversation happening about afrobeats or about any genre that you're an expert in that no one is speaking for you you know say that's yeah. that's the that's a big that's thing. the big thing bro because i well, you know i mean totally off the record but that's well that's the well, that well like malon uh, first of all i appreciate you sharing this information this is very valuable Absolutely. It's very valuable. I've been working with Pages for a long time, you know, with everything that he's doing and I appreciate you, brother, you know, looking out for us. 
um, the bottom line here is you you understand Afrobeat and what we do adds value. And I appreciate you taking the time to make sure that we get on this. Yep. Absolutely. You know, this is your category, world. Yeah. World. World music. World music yeah, new yeah. age. World music. New age. Marlon. You need to hold our hand. That's the bottom line. And I see you already reaching out. You're already holding our hand. So let's make sure we do. Anything we need to do, make, let us know. Wonderful. We will do it. I'm based here in LA. Oh, wonderful. My, the, we've been working with Diamond from the beginning. Yeah. Wonderful. Okay, wonderful. So, yeah. so I want you to hold our hand. Let's, listen, our, all we want, all we want is we need to be here. Yeah. This is the pinnacle 100%. of the music industry. that are still pushing um, but ultimately you know this is a community thing this is a much bigger thing than like you know just you or I you know this is like pulling other people up to, to be part of this thing you know or to make sure that when there's a conversation happening about Afrobeats or about any genre that you're an expert in that no one is speaking for you you know what I'm saying that's, yeah. that's the that's a big that's thing. the big thing bro because I well, you know I mean Totally off the record, but that, well, that's the well, that well, like Marlon. Uh, first of all, I appreciate you sharing this information. This is very valuable. Absolutely, this is very valuable. I've been working with Pages for a long time, you know, with everything that he's doing, and I appreciate you, brother. You know, looking out for us. Um, the bottom line here is, you you understand Afrobeat and what we do adds value. And I appreciate you taking the time to make sure that we get on this. Yep. Absolutely. You know, this is your category, world. Yeah. World. World music. World music yeah, new yeah. age. World music. New age. Marlon. You need to hold our hand. That's the bottom line. And I see you already reaching out. You're already holding our hand. So let's make sure we do anything we need to do. Make. Let us know. Wonderful. We will do it. I'm based here in LA. Oh, wonderful! My, the, we've been working with Diamond from the beginning. Yeah. Wonderful. Okay, wonderful. so yeah. so I want you to hold our hand. Let's listen. Our all we want, all we want, is we need to be here. Yeah, this is the pinnacle 100%. of the music industry. I've been your host, Sydney C. Till next time, Russia TV.